What's happening free game? We are coming to you live, but not live, from inside our home in London. We're going to be showing you a day in the life of our family and what we do. It's more focused on Jojo, to be honest. Yeah, he's the centre of everything, isn't he? Yeah. But not literally the centre. <laughs> Somebody wanted to know what uh, sort, of, sort of things Jojo does with his learning in a day. Yeah. And so it's more focused around him. We did do a morning routine video about a year ago. You can sit it up in the corner if you want to find out what that was like. But things... Do change with us. Jojo's learning and the things he gets interested in changes and we adapt with them. Things for us change as well in our routines. Yeah, so we're always having to evolve everything really and uh, just to meet his needs. Yeah, so what have we done already this morning? Yeah, so we always start off our day. We did film this because we have shown it in previous videos before, but we always find it very important to start our day with what we call our thank yous. This is our gratitude for the things we're grateful in life. And this can be from anything very simple to the air we breathe, water, fresh water, the trees, the sun, different sorts of things which we find that we are grateful to have in our lives. We find it really powerful, don't we? Yeah. <laughs> what else is really powerful is Jojo figuring out that he can see himself in the camera. <laughs> He's enjoying it a bit too much. <laughs> No! Yes, we, we just feel it's really important to be grateful for things. It makes you appreciate the things you have in life, but it also, if any of you guys know anything about the law of attraction, it helps bring more of what you want into your life. And he's gone. And Jojo just jumped down. But then after that, we'll get up, we'll have water, won't we? Just laughing at Jojo on the floor. <laughs> yeah, we'll have some water. It's always good to hydrate yourself because you do dehydrate while you sleep. And then we get into our yoga, don't we? Me and Bob, and Jojo, we all clean up the place. So if we hadn't, if we haven't cleaned up the night before, then we get the hoover out, we hoover around and just make our bed. Because I can't really like focus on anything when, the, place, everything, when the place is too much of a mess. <laughs> <laughs> I could hear it, couldn't see it. That's Jojo's exercise routine for the day. Yeah, and yoga we find as well is something that just releases a lot of energy. It kind of your muscles can be maybe a bit tight from sleeping, so it just helps ease you into the day nicely. Yeah, so we did our yoga. And while we do that, Jojo has his breakfast. And yeah, he had a big bowl of porridge this morning, which is pretty normal. He has it pretty much every day. It's already really a good starter for the day, porridge. Mm. Gets so much good in there. And then he moves on to his first homeschooling activity, which is his handwriting. And this is one of the core things we believe is essential for him to practice a little bit every day. And we get to let him choose what he wants to do with regards to handwriting. Like if he wants sometimes, He's written a story, sometimes he's written a comic book. Uh, with, you did Tom Riddle's diary where you wrote back and forth to each yeah, other. Yeah, sometimes he writes uh, letters to his, he's got a few pen pals. As you yeah. know, Sienna is one of his pen pals. Yeah, today he wrote in his... A little textbook, yeah. I mean, he does about 10 to 15 minutes a day writing, doesn't he? If he wants to do more, he can, but mm. we just find a little bit a day just helps that carry on. But what we've introduced now, all of a sudden, come up with me, mummy. What we have introduced is a star tracking system. I love the way she's standing there, like displaying it. Wave your hand, that's it, good. You could win this at the end of today's video. Not really. So we um, didn't really agree with like reward systems before and sticker and star systems. Yeah, in wasn't... general, wasn't it? Yeah. I think it was that we felt, do they necessarily get why they're doing it if they're just going for a yeah. reward? Are they just doing it for the star? or are they doing it because they understand why they're doing these things. But anyway, Jojo decided that he wanted to start having a star system. And actually, it's, but we started it actually at the beginning of this week when we came back from holiday. And he's really taken to it. He's really um, enjoyed having this. And so what we've got here is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. We used to do homeschooling every day, but we just found um, we needed more of a routine. That's why we do it Monday to Friday now. Yeah. He still does things like reading and things like that um, every, every day and yeah. a bit of writing on the weekends. There's reading, writing and maths, they're core ones which we've decided he'll need in life no matter what. Yeah. We'd like him as well to learn a language and we let him choose which language. As yeah. you know, he's learning Spanish. He's learning Spanish. The other things, the two things that he's chosen this week are music and learning the time. Now, music will probably carry on for many, many more weeks. Mm. because obviously it's an instrument you're not going to pick it up in a week. That would be great if you did. Yeah. And he's currently learning two instruments at the moment. One is guitar, the other one, which he does 
once every week. You're going to find out later because he's doing it later today. Also, he's decided he wants to learn time. He knows a little bit how to tell the time, but he wanted a, a new watch. So we bought him a watch. And yeah, so that's one thing we do for about 10, 15 minutes is show him how to tell the time. Yeah, and that'll probably this week or maybe next week, he'll end up learning enough and then he'll replace it with another subject of his choice. This is Jojo's new watch that we got him. Super racing watch. Yeah, he got one with racing cars on it. So every now and then we'll say to him, what's time Jojo? And he has to tell us what the time is as well. So as you can see, today is Thursday. He already got his star for handwriting. So the next thing he tends to do after he's done his handwriting is reading and Spanish with mummy. Yes. We've kind of got a system now where you're taking some of the things with him and I'm doing the other ones, aren't I? But yeah. yesterday, like we, you know, we're rearranging. Like yesterday I had to go out, I had some filming to do somewhere and you just took over pretty much everything, didn't you? Yeah, because Bob's working on a big advertising campaign. Yeah, with lots of celebrities. I'm actually going to be working with someone from EastEnders next week, which is quite interesting as well. I haven't watched EastEnders for about 10 years. So I'm going to go and get on with uh, Jojo's reading and Spanish now. We always do it in the bedroom because we find it nice and calm in there. And Bob's going to get on with his work because, you know, we have to do our own work around Jojo's school in as well, so. Yeah. Like together and with a few other people, we run a clothing company. You can check out our merch, Ethics. Go to ethics.com. We've actually got a 20% sale on at the moment, so get in there quick if you want to grab some of the nice merch. We are working on some free gang merch. Yeah, it's free gang specific merch. So yeah, keep your eyes peeled for that. Only because you guys have asked for it. So that's a good balance that we have. That one will do the schooling with Jojo, the other one will do the creativity, and then we swap over, don't we? Yeah. Anyway, that's enough talking. Get your reading in Spanish done. So what are you choosing for books, Jojo? I have no idea. I'm just going to pick random ones. You're grabbing all of those? Yeah. Wow, that's quite a lot of books. It's about six. So when we read, I normally read as well. We read together. I'll read one book and you read one book. So there's six. Jojo's picked six books. And they're quite short books, these ones. So I'll read three. He can read three. You like listening to me read and following the words as well when I read. It's good for Jojo to help to hear other people read so he can hear how the words are correctly pronounced. What book do you want to start with, Jojo? I think you might want to start with this one. The Sing Song? Yes. Okay. So while those two are reading in the bedroom, I'm going to fix myself some breakfast to have while I do my creativity. I'm going to have a nice smoothie this morning. I normally like something hydrating to start the day. Lots of bananas and dates and maybe even peanut butter in there as well. But don't tell Katie, that's quite a cheeky one. Okay, I won't do peanut butter. Have you ever had peanut butter in a smoothie? Comment below. It is the best thing. Let us know what kind of things you like having in a smoothie as well. What are you going to do now? Put your star on the chart? So you're trying to keep them the same colours, eh? There we go. Now what are you doing? Spanish. Cool. So we're doing Spanish now. Jojo doesn't normally have screens. We don't normally uh, allow him to have screens until all his schooling is done. But we do make exceptions with his Spanish because he learns with an app called Duolingo, which is really cool. Look at all these Spanish things. Yeah. All done then? Si. Si. So Daddy normally does your maths with you, doesn't he? Mm -hmm. But today Daddy is extra busy, so we're going to do maths together. And what are we going to use for your maths? We're going to use dye. We're going to use all this pastry. So what are we going to do with it? What kind of things do you want to do? We're going to do some fractions. We can do some fractions. We Maybe can do some division. Division. Yeah, and then the best thing of all is we can make biscuits out of it and we can eat them later. Yes! The best thing to do for each day is to do squish it around like this to make it into shape.
Right, Jojo, can you cut it into quarters? <laughs> Good. Now can you do eight? Well done. And can you take out three eighths? It's gonna be a pizza. Awesome. Be a pizza. So what fraction is left over? There's five eighths. That's right, well done. Should we do some division now? So we're doing nine divided by three right now, yes? Yeah. So you've got three children, nine cupcakes. What's nine divided by three? So, give one to that one, one to that one, one to that one, and give one to that one, 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 one to that one. one, to that one. So what's the answer? Nine divided by three is three. Well done. Right, should we do another sum? Let's do 10 more sums. 10. Okay. We'll do 10 more, yeah? Okay. I'll put this down. So 12 divided by four is? Three! Yeah, well done. So 15 divided by five is? Is three. Three, oh, well done. They have something. So we're all done with maths now. What are you going to do now, Jojo? We're going to make biscuits. What shapes are you going to do? We're going to do star, bike, pineapple and gingerbread now. So your biscuits are in the oven, Jojo? Mm -hmm. Do you want to do your maths star? I think we forgot to tell everyone. What do you get when you fill up all your stars? I get this. Yes, every week you can have a treat. Sometimes it might be a Lego set. But Lego set, you still you still learn a lot from Lego sets, don't you? It teaches you patience, how to follow instructions, stuff like that. Like it sort of teaches me like to like build stuff like really well out of Lego. Comment below if you know what film this Lego set is from. And comment below if you watched that film as well. You watched it on the aeroplane, didn't you? Yes. You put your math sticker on. Yeah. Um, so what have you got left today? I've got music and time. So Jojo's just done his math sticker. Yep. Now I'm going to do his tight learning time with him. And then we're going to go and get you washed and dressed. And get you ready for your music lesson. Yeah, because it's still early because all this is normally done in the morning. That's why you guys don't normally see it. We don't normally film yeah. anything for the channel until after 12. We normally go from 7 to 11 or 7 till 12. Yeah. The only thing that he'll be doing later is his music lesson because yeah. his music teacher is coming round here to yeah, teach him. Yeah, and schedule that time, otherwise he would have learned guitar by now, wouldn't he? What we have to show you guys is what is a very, very important part of the day. Maybe not as important as monsters, but this is the time of the day where we feed Scaredy Cat and Raven Raven. Uh, scaredy Cat, what are you thinking of having to eat for dinner? Something with cinnamon. Oh, I think that can be arranged. Also, Scaredy Cat, you sound a bit different. What's going on with your voice? Just trying to fit in with living in London. Well, you sound like you're fitting in absolutely fine. Well, what about you, Raven Raven? What are you going to be having? Oh, pretty much same as usual then. Right, now you're all dressed. Do you want some of your biscuits that you made? Yes. Do you want jam on them? There's your knife, you can spread the jam onto them if you want. Oh look, you made a face on that one. Mm -hmm. That's cute. So apart from his music lesson which is coming later, that is most of Jojo's learning done. So he's just chilling out with a little snack and a drink right now. And watching Alpha Blocks, eh? We love Alpha Blocks, it's got a great theme tune. 
And you learn a bit from Alpha Blocks as well, don't you? Yeah, I learn about phonics, and it actually does say title Phonics Alpha Blocks. Okay, well, I mean, you learnt phonics like, when you were two years old, so. Yeah. <laughs> Just a refresher, I guess. And I'm also joining in on the snackage. Some of these biscuits that Jojo and Mummy made some jam on and a cup of tea. So normally this is a good time as well when Jojo is settling down, if he's watching stuff, we can start getting two things. I'm carrying on with my creativity. Mummy's just doing a bit of cleaning up and then she's doing some creativity as well. And then she'll be getting some lunch on the go as well. So snacks and everything is done. We've just had a little settle down now. This is a very essential time of the day. Very essential. Very, very important part of our day in the life routine. And that is playing monsters. All right, I'll be honest, we don't do it absolutely every day. We do it at least five days a week though. At least five times a day. <laughs> this boy has insisted it should be part of the morning routine and everything, but yeah, we're not gonna show you monsters this time. So if you do wanna see all the mayhem that happens and how Katie accidentally sometimes gets hurt. <laughs> <laughs> then you can check it out in the video up in the corner. But in the meantime, Monster time! Ah. So we've had to come into the bedroom now, guys, because Jojo's music teacher is here, Cammy, And um, so we're having to, having to be a little bit quiet in here. Uh, we were gonna go out for a walk, but we've both got work to do, so. Yeah, and just by the time we went out, we'd have to turn around. Yeah. <laughs> Normally he goes to her for the music lesson, but she's coming here today because- she's, she's moving at the moment, so she's got a lot of stuff. Yeah. Everywhere at the moment. Comment below if you can guess what instrument he is currently learning though. We haven't told you anything yet, but yeah, let us know in the comments. For those of you that follow our Instagram and you saw a post the other day of him sitting with the instrument, you'll know. Comment below if you know what that instrument is and yeah. if you saw that post. Yeah, so when he's done with our lesson, we'll go in there and maybe he might be able to play us something. Yeah, maybe. Hopefully we'll be able to video him as well. He did last week, didn't he? Yeah. Sounds like Jojo's all done with his lesson now. Let's go in. Let's go and see what's happened. She's playing the maraca. What's going on, you two? We were just playing a little game of shake the rattle and guess the animal. Oh. <laughs> rattle snake every time? Rattle snake every time, then. So, Jojo, do you want to tell the free game what you've been learning to play with Cammy? Okay, so I've been learning harp. Yeah, wow. This is your wow. second lesson. Mm. Are you going to play a song for us? Yeah. Wow. It's just going to get straight into it, aren't you, Jojo? Uh, I've been hearing. Oh! <laughs> My finger is so hurting right now. Oh, <laughs> Jojo, do you reckon you could do just a little bit of that really quick little Putting your music sticker on there. Oh, fantastic. Oh. It's a star sticker. Well done. So you've only got one more day left. Yes. Okay, guys, that's it for today. We're going to say goodbye as we are going to be heading out to go to a park and Jojo's going to be meeting some friends. So we've got already filmed there, so we thought we'd end the video here today. But before we do, we're going to give some shout outs to some of you lovely free gang who have been requesting them. And Jojo's just gone into the front room. He's going to go get ready for us to go out. So shout outs to 
Katie Hattersley and her kitten Kiki. Also a shout out to Kirsty Isabel, Princess Tink 1994, Jade, whose birthday is on the 6th of October. Hope you have a great birthday. Shout out to Puff the Magic Dragon too, Jasmine Edmonds, Willie Mitchell, Undertaker123, Bruce Seeger Pope, Isabella Jones, Moozles, Patricia Larkin, Summer's Life, Stacey Johnston, Eleanor James, and last shout out is to Tommy. This is uh, requested from your wife, uh, Shelby Cunningham. And I understand you have just completed your master's degree and on your birthday as well. So not only happy birthday, but wow. congratulations, well done. You are the boss. I hope that was a nice birthday present to finally get through that. That's some good work there. It's an inspiration out there for you, gang. But yeah, thank you so much for watching today's video. If any of you guys are new to this channel and you like seeing about our life and the things we do, and the very important things we have to prioritize like monsters, then we'd love it if you subscribed and followed our channel. And hit that notification bell too so you're kept up to date on when we do upload videos and we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks so much, peace out.